Oh gosh, no. <laughs> Way I look. Well, I don't care real quick, but look at me. She wants more food in interview. Get it. That I know of on this side. Yes, sir. Go ahead and tell me your first last name, spell it for me. My name is Dina Reese, D-E-A-N-A, -E Reese, R-U-I-Z. And I just happened to look out my, my bedroom window and this whole property was on fire. It was all the way here coming through our property. And three of my guys that uh, are here all the time, they ended up getting that corner over there, starting there and, and got it wet enough. My two guys did this whole, whole uh, line right here be, and has saved it from burning our house and burning our property down. But it originated in the middle right there where um, obviously maybe it was a, a bottle or something, um, but this, this guy's property has been um, pretty not maintained for a long time. But um, I just thank God that, that uh, my people were here and for all of you guys, because if it wasn't for this and us coming out here and watering everything down, um, we would have we would have lost our property after 22 years. So, so go ahead and tell us, on your, I uh, see you melted your fence right here. What's behind the fence? Like what's on your property? There's a lot of uh, nice cars. That yes, we're we have an acre. Uh, my husband's hobby is um, hot rods, and so uh, he has a he has a lot of gems here for himself. And um, yeah, we would have really, really lost a lot of precious things that we have. And like I said, thanks to our guys and me and the neighbors out here um, watering on both sides. Um, we were able to save our property, but as you can see, it was melting. It was coming through and starting in on our property. And I'm just grateful that for you guys, everybody, all the uh, firefighters and everything that were able to save my property. Have you ever had anything like this in the past? No, I've lived here for almost 23 years, since 2002. And um, we've never had anything like this happen, ever. Not even close around us. Maybe a little brush fire that way, but nothing that we're going to like um, 
um, burn structures down. So we're very fortunate that we everything's okay. When you first seen it, what was your thoughts? Did you think it was going to get your house, or what yes, was going through I, your mind? Yes, my first thought was I have taken my elderly mom. My first thought was to get my mom out, and so I chose to to run back here and just uh, get a hose and start helping, and um, until you guys got here. But uh, thank God I didn't have to do that. How, how old is your mom? She's 81 years old. Yes, oh, and job. she's she's bedridden, so it would have been. You know, my husband's not home right now, so it would have been a minute to get me out, but I would have done what I had to do. So. Well, it looks like you all did a great job. Save yes, the home. thank you. All right. Cool. So tell me your first and last name and spell it for me. Uh, my name is, uh, mi nombre es Erlinda Kraber. Okay. How do you spell um, it? Um, Erlinda, I don't know. No hablo muy bien, muy bien inglés, pero esta propiedad, la mitad es mía. Um, Estamos en, en problemas. Uh, mis hijos quieren quedarse con toda la propiedad, que no, no, no quieren darme la mitad que me corresponde. Y yo no sé cómo es que eh, se ha quemado así. Y me gustaría saber uh, si alguien me puede dar una explicación cómo es que se ha quemado, porque esa camioneta es, uh, es de mí. Y ese tráiler de ahí es de mí y tenía muchas cosas ahí en, en las bodegas y, y como estamos en juicio, no sé, me gustaría que alguien me diera una explicación quién es que lo ha quemado esto. Uh, eso es lo que yo puedo decir y gracias a, a los bomberos que, que han venido a ayudar, si no se hubiera quemado mi camioneta y, y mi, mi, mis casas y, y se hubiera quemado mi, mi tráiler. Gracias. You're welcome. Did nobody got hurt? No injuries? Eh, no sé, acabo de llegar yo y estaba... Vi el humo y entonces vine para ver que parecía que estaba saliendo de mi casa. Entonces vine, pero yo no sé si, si alguien ha, ha, ha sido lastimado. No creo. Uh -huh.